and silence. All right, <laughs> um, it's your girl Laquanda holding it down and you are currently tuned in to be on the surface. A super special episode with my entire cast of the brand new short film coming soon, Date Bait, the mm -hmm. short film. Check it out, check it out, check it out. Clap for me, so Well, it's not my cast per se, because I did not direct it, but I did co-write it. That's the director right there, El Daddio, who's also filming the show of ED Productions. Let's salute him, please. Yes, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. He makes everything possible. Him and Jesus. Him and Jesus. <laughs> no, uh, this, Come is, on now. this is the, the <laughs> <laughs> uh, main the cast. I'm going to give everybody, let everybody say their name and briefly say what you do and what your character's name is as well in the short film. Okay. So, for instance, you're Niall. Yes. And then you nice. say your character's name. Okay, I'm Niall. And then just briefly what you do. Right. So I'm Nayel and I play Nicole or Cinnamon um, and I work in customer service and my character also works in customer service just in a different way. So yeah, stay tuned. Pass it along. All right, next. I am Jay Marjorie. I play the role of Bryce. I think that's what they told me, yes. right? That's what I was. Uh, he never knows um, his name, I never, know, I never know my name. He's I also so work in customer service, but I actually have customers. So, like, you'll, see, you'll see what I mean when the, when the movie comes out. Definitely. So, all right, what up, y'all? I'm Brian McClain. Uh, I play Sheldon, the boy, one of the boys. Uh, <laughs> the, boy, the boy. The boy. <laughs> the boy. <laughs> this is one of them. His daddy um, got a master. Okay. We, we, work, <laughs> we work together at the same place where we deal with people, lovely people, every single day. Mm -hmm. Oh, and I, I work for uh, the state of North Carolina. You're not going to tell me your real job. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's what we were doing. I, I didn't get into it, though. Just to stay. Don't tell the truth. And hi everybody, I'm Monika <laughs> Edwards. I play Maya. I am Nicole's friend. And we also work together. We're co-workers. Uh -huh. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> Hi, my name is Rasheen El Daddy Cobb. I play David, one of uh, Bryce's best friends. Um, I ain't got no job. I just be all over the place. <laughs> And I like to tell people what to do. His name is also Tommy. Tommy, 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 Tommy Strong. Right. He's Tommy. Tommy. Yeah. 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 Oh, and I'm also the director and uh, writer. cameraman. He writer, created the project creator. and yeah. all that good Look stuff. Look at all those slashes. Um, slash, okay. slash, okay. slash, 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 slash. Slash, slash, slash. I keep my hands everywhere. Keep, keep your hands to yourself. Uh oh. Ooh. 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 That's my baby daddy. Well, uh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. And myself, I'm Laquana. I play Alexis in the film. I make a cameo appearance. I didn't want to make it about me. Um, no, and um, I play uh, a hairstylist and also friends of the girls, and we have a good time. We just did an amazing photo shoot yes. with the cast, and it's other people who are also in the film as well, but we just wanted to get the core of what's happening, and it's an amazing film. Would you say? Yes, definitely. Yes. I'm excited. Yes. I'm ready. So I have some questions for them um, pertaining to the film and some personal things with Regards to dating, if you will, because uh -oh. the film is called what? Dating. 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 Absolutely. All right. So, all right. Oh, sorry, baby. So, okay. tell the people briefly why you decided to be a part of the project, and that goes for all of you. Mm. Why you decided to be a part of it? I'll start. <laughs> um, I, I just like the whole like script, the whole thing. Like, I just thought it was a good setup. Um, even down to like the ending. I'm not gonna give too much away, but it's definitely something that I've been related to. So, um, I just really got into character. So, Bryce, wait a minute, Bryce, that's interesting. That's all the way. That's all the way. I got some very interesting. He said, uh, I'm uh, wondering which part. Which part? It's just the, the physical part. I almost, physical I almost said I've something. Actually related. To so that. you were basically connected. To the yes, exactly. <laughs> She's giving the dirty look now, like. Well, then. okay. <laughs> that, I just learned something new. <laughs> um, so I, I had seen uh, Laquana in a show uh, some months before. We, I actually saw the casting, and I was like. Well, she's good people, uh, and so I saw, Wrong and then I choice. saw some of uh, El, El Daniel's work, and I was like, okay, they 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 were doing some quality stuff over there. So, uh, and I, then I got the script, and I was saw what the actual story, uh, the synopsis of the story was. I was like, okay, it's going to be interesting. So, I definitely, I love acting anyway, and I love material that's that's. Uh, that's strong, mm -hmm. and that that's actually something for you to do, and it actually evolves in some way. So he made me feel real good the way he said. They said yeah. it evolved, it's quality <laughs> and stuff. Right. I'll pay you later. All right. <laughs> All right. Um. Well, I'm new to the area. I've been wanting to get back into doing some acting, and uh, I ran across their Facebook page, and I saw it that they were looking for some actors and actresses, and I mm -hmm. said. Well, cool. go ahead and give it a shot. Yeah. Go for it. There you go. And, uh, That's it. I saw the script and I was just like, oh, yeah. 
Let's, Let's go. Let's, Let's do, do this. <laughs> Lika. Um, me personally, um, Date Date, I think is adult short film. Mm -hmm. I feel like a lot of young people and older people can relate to it. Definitely. Um, social media is a big thing nowadays. Mm -hmm. yeah. So um, I'm just excited to be a part of it. My character fits me. I didn't even have to change who I was. Right, right. <laughs> Let's just change my name. I'm putting exactly. a lot right now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. Right. Exactly. All right, you know, <laughs> Damn. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> We're just really good at We're casting right, because yeah. we catch people. Right. And wow. We catch their personalities. Yeah. You know, yeah. Capture their type. verbal essences. Yeah. <laughs> Fresh okay. Okay. Um, pretty much, I created Date Bait. It come from a song I wrote in 2009 mm -hmm. um, called On Her Back. And it was based off a girl named Nicole. And the song's a little different, but that's pretty much where the, the core comes from about a young girl that was going through things, dating different men, and it led to a whole different. <laughs> <laughs> it led to so a whole it's different. So it's really not. Yeah. <laughs> her life spiraled out of control. I want to hear on her well, back now. Yeah. Well, on her back now. <laughs> so, yeah, I want to hear that. It's on. Actually, on her back. That one. No, it's, it's on. Uh, it's on that piff. It's oh, on that piff. Yeah. I got it's that on a mixtape that I did years ago. <laughs> I'm about to listen but to yeah, it. But um, yeah, <laughs> on her back. But yeah, it's a Are song you I can't add do. That song into day -day? Nah, I'm thinking about doing a new one. Okay. Okay. Right. okay. All right. All right. All right. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's pretty much where it come from. I said, you know what? Why not put it? You know, write a movie about it. Um, get some quality people, mm -hmm. and let's let's do it. And now we have a whole movie that's Amen. all done. Yes. yes. Regarding a stripper who had a really rough life, she, she maybe something like that. Oh, you know, something back. like that. And it's loosely based because it's not probably like that. Yeah, we cleaned like, it up a little that's bit. Another, that's another whole thing. That's, 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 that's like a web like series <laughs> right there. On her back. On her back. I love that. And every episode she is up on her back. Think about that. In the future, make it a web series. That's what else on her back. That's what else on her back. Right, yeah. We went actually talk to you guys about that. What you just said? There's some things we're thinking about. <laughs> this cast, obviously, we get along. Thank God. Yes. Seriously. Um, you, really quickly. Um, what do you feel was the most challenging for you going from a song and transitioning that into creating the film? What was the most challenging part about that? Um, I just turned into Oprah, guys. Just stretch, I just, got real. <laughs> just pretty much stretching, stretching the song and just putting... It wasn't really that challenging. It, if, if anything, gave me more opportunity to express mm -hmm. what the song was about. Because now I could add different elements with Bryce is doing for work, what she does for work, who's her friends, what she's going through outside of dating. And it, it allowed me an opportunity to expand on what she was going through, pretty much everyone, what everybody was going through. Right. And multiple people that's probably going through it right now that don't yeah. talk about it. Right. And because we're all talking about the film, we haven't really told the people per se, what the movie kind of is about. Who right. would love to give that information? Just a briefing of what Date Bait is about. Malika, you got, because I like Malika. Malika be like, I'm ready. <laughs> <laughs> Malika, can you give the people a little My bit? My personal opinion what and concept of Date Bait, I feel like it's just teaching you a lesson because nowadays, everything is online, mm -hmm. social media. There's not a lot of face-to-face -face connection going on right. or actually getting to know a person. So we're just trying to give you... Um, like the pointers and how to be safe and how to go about it the mm -hmm. right way and the right. wrong way of doing things so um date date is is i'm telling you is 2019 2000 i mean 2020 get ready get ready, get ready. yes yeah. definitely yeah. Young the thing is, to you can be whoever you want to be online mm -hmm. right, right. Exactly. I, think that's, I think that's what it's, that's where the, the core is that yes. you can be whoever you want to be and then sometimes you can't you can't face who you really are right, right. Yeah. right. and then and once you do it turns into it something turns into something else. Different. Very catfishy. Right. Yes. Yeah, very much. And that's, and that's where I think experiences I've seen from multiple people. It's real, like you said, real catfishy. Catfish. So yeah. people, yeah. like you said, you could you could create a whole person online, mm -hmm. and people will believe if they see little small clips of what you do. People really believe this is who you, you are at right. the end yeah. of the day. But the sad part is you start believing it yourself. Right. Right. That's, that's right. The, and that's you the scary part too. That is very scary. Because mental health. Believing your own life. Right. Right. So. Yeah. Yeah, mental health as well. What sort of person um, is going to relate to your character, each of you? Because that's really important of who you are. What person mm. is going to say, ooh, that's I can connect with that. Like, what do you think? And we'll start with you, Marjorie, because I'm going to shift around and give everybody a moment. Wow, okay. Um, hmm. I think the person who, who's looking for love, but they're not exactly sure how to go about doing it, I think for one, for one thing, you have to love yourself. And if you don't, it shows, and it, it, it becomes toxic. Mm -hmm. And I think that uh, Bryce, he becomes a toxic person. 
because he's looking for something that he doesn't know how to get himself. Mm -hmm. And when he thinks that he has it, his, he's turned into something else. He turns into something else. Mm -hmm. I don't really think that he is, but because the situation presents itself, he goes about it the wrong way. Okay. I like that. Yeah. Okay. Brian, give me a little something. What you think? Um, well, as far as uh, Sheldon goes, um, I mean, of course, he's one of Bryce's best friends. So, you know, he's going to support him in everything that he does. But at the same time, you know, he is going to try to tell him the truth. And, you know, he's going to try to, I mean, it's, it's kind of an iffy situation because guys look at things a lot differently, mm. especially in this situation, than, than females. So, you know, even though you know, I'm going to tell you the truth at the same time, I might be like, well, you know what, go ahead and do your thing. Just you know, enjoy, enjoy it. <laughs> because, you know, if, if I can tell that you ain't planning to stay there, I'm not going to really push you to tell the truth too much. Mm. So I'm going to just, you know, I'm going to give you a little bit of truth, but then I'm going to be like, yo, just go do your thing. Mm -hmm. So I think, you know, that type of, you know, that's... So he's an enabler? He's an enabler. He's an enabler. Yeah, yeah. so enabler. Right. Yeah. We like to identify exactly okay. what kind of people we're dealing with here. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Nayo? Um, I think the type of person that would connect to Nicole would be a woman who's just battling insecurities and trying to find her self-worth. Um, maybe someone who wants more for herself, but isn't really putting herself out there enough um i definitely think that she she just knows like she 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 can she has potential to be a lot more than what she is and i think she's settling and i think that it is women out there that do that mm -hmm. kind of stuff and they just don't i don't know maybe not have the motivation or the confidence to put their self forward and you know apply their self more and i think that she's that type of person and that's why she kind of you know meet up with people offline and you know she just kind of picks up on stuff because she's not really i don't know she doesn't know her self-worth basically mm. That's a, that was a great one right there. Y'all heard that? We get deep here, don't we? <laughs> it's called Beyond the Surface. Okay. We got enablers, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Evolving people. Like, we got <laughs> <laughs> right. um, Malika, share your thoughts on what kind of person is going to relate to your character. Um, My character, Maya. <laughs> She's like, I forgot her name. <laughs> <laughs> um. She's a very outgoing, funny best friend of Nicole. Mm -hmm. She give her good advice, and she tell and she's the type to try to get Nicole to love herself and mm -hmm. stop um, doubting who she is. And I always try to tell. I mean, well, Maya try to tell Nicole <laughs> she don't need love. To she said at me, you right. know. So right, you know, I'm just that good friend. You got one of those good best friends that's in the background, right. like, like hey, keep girl. it real with you, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. right. <laughs> She said me, me, not me, um, <laughs> Maya. <laughs> Girl. Guys, got that right. That's real life for her. Right, it's real life. I told you. <laughs> she said what heart. Right. What she give Um, David, um, is that character that's raw and truthful? Truthful, meaning he's <laughs> truthful. gonna he's gonna call Bryce out. On his on his stuff, right. right. So he's not gonna let Bryce. Well, he's not the enabler. Front. Mm -hmm. <laughs> right. He's not gonna let Bryce or Sheldon front like right. there's something right. that they not because he's the friend that's gonna call you out on your BS every single time and there's nothing else different you can tell. Them. <laughs> that's who David is. That makes sense. Mm -hmm. I, I mean, I watched the movie, so I pretty much know. Oh, you seen it? Went down. You seen it already? It's coming soon. Oh, okay. I'm trying to see it too. Let me get some thoughts on that velvet rope. <laughs> um, Alexis, really quickly. Um, it's weird doing this because you're hosting, and then I'm like, oh, I'm a part of it too. Mm -hmm. So, um, Alexis is the kind of person who is carefree but not careless. Mm -hmm. She wants mm -hmm. you to enjoy That's life. Good. Um, do things to have fun, but don't put yourself in situations that can harm you or put you in harm's way, rather. So I think that's the kind of friend she is for Nicole. The, the, she's ride or die. She's there for a friend, but it's also like, I want you to be a little bit smarter about this. Right. You know, you can have fun, but don't put yourself in harm's way. And I think that's who Alexis tends to be. Boom. I hooked y'all up. There with it is. Like You're ready for that one. All right. Um, yeah. <laughs> um, if someone's going to play you in your life story, if you decide to finally get a movie for yourself, Mm. Right, like Madrice has a brand new movie. Niall's like, oh, my movie's finally here. What actor is going to play you in said movie? 
about your life story. <laughs> Each and every one of them. I gotta ponder on oh, that. Oh man, that's a good question. It's my person. We only got like three minutes I can't left. play myself. Look, see, I didn't even know it, but I got like three minutes so left. So we can't play ourselves. We actually have to pick someone. We you pick have to pick somebody? someone to portray you. Oh. I would say Eva Marcel for me. And okay. She's also a model, but she does act as well. She's mm -hmm. an actress. And she got that face too. And I think that we just have a lot of similarities as mm -hmm. far as, not even just like looks wise, just our attitudes. Like she has a real spunky personality. She's real goofy and silly mm -hmm. when you see her behind the scenes. And y'all know how I am behind the scenes. Yes, she's a so, goofball. <laughs> yes. So, so I definitely think I would say even Marcel for me. Nice. All right. Uh, Forrest Whitaker. He's one of my favorite, oh, one of my favorite oh, actors. He came yeah. through. Come yeah. on, Godfather. Yeah. Yeah. He is. I, I, Off topic. Are you watching Godfather of Holland? I'm not. My dad's really good. Better, I'm not, I, I, don't good. Have, I don't have centrics. I just find out. Is it epic. 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 epic? epic. See, I don't even know what it is. Right. <laughs> 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 Do but you no, have a fire stick, you better just get that. Yeah. Call the ancestors and tell them to help you figure right. it out, child. I, I get am, it together. I am. <laughs> no, his, his, you gotta his watch work, it. His, his, body, his book, body of work is incredible. Yeah. Like, you know what I mean? Definitely. Like, come on, man. Yeah, he's amazing. And so I, I've That's always looked like that to him. That's yeah. a good story. Yeah. Okay. I like that. I love Forrest Whitaker. All right, Brian, who gonna play you in the movie? Right. Oh, man. Uh, <laughs> Jim Parsons. Right. Sheldon. Sheldon. I mean, I have a big, big man. One of my favorite actors. I would, I would say Jamie Foxx okay. because, okay. I, you know, when he did uh, Ray, that that movie was one of the movies that, yeah, I mean, it really spoke to me. Yeah, yeah, he got Definitely. in. Yeah, you yeah know? he went all in. Great pick, great pick. And great pick. I, feel like, I feel like a lot of the stuff that I've been through, he could bring that emotion out. Okay, wow. that's a good one. So, cool. I like it. Mm -hmm. Phone Lika. Who? I don't know who. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> who would y'all pick to play my Girl, role? Uh, my, uh, tell my life story. Regina Hall. You mm. remind me of her. Regina Hall. Yeah. Yeah. She reminds yeah. me so much of her. She has that, she has that line between goofy and yeah, serious. And yeah. serious. Yeah. And serious. We found somebody for Regina. Yeah. If you're Regina, watching, Regina. you can play with me. Come on, y'all call us. Call us. <laughs> you can call us, right? Right. Okay, Regina, who do you think? Um, to play me in a movie? Absolutely. What's his name? Chadwick Boseman. You hear you go, you think you Black Panther. You see this guy. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, because he, he but who played people no, really good. Yeah. 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 He, 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 he plays everybody. He plays everybody on the team. Right. Everybody on the team. That's a good You sprinkle a little Spike Lee up in there. Oh, God. Okay. Don't okay. Man. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta make sure. Chadwick's a good choice. He's a good choice. Who are you picking? He's versatile. Um... Interesting. Um, I think Taraji P. Henson would play a good okay. Laquana for now until someone else comes in my head. But I think she's really good at dramatic roles as well. Mm -hmm. And she's mm -hmm. so good at being silly and so good at being the ghetto girl when it needs to be right. the ghetto girl. She can portray a lot of different things. Right. And me being the multiple personality type of person that I am, I think she'll be able to capture mm -hmm. my essence. Yeah. So, okay. yeah, I think that'll work. What do you think the audience will take away from this film, each of you? What um, do you think? Okay. Well, me personally, <laughs> I feel like, you know, it's a real, it, it's a, it got some comedy parts in it, but it's really a seriousness behind it. Like, in all seriousness, you don't just meet up with people on the internet and just think it's safe to, you know, go out with them and stuff. I mean, I understand these days that that's kind of how things work, but be precautious. Put your location on, you know, whatever you got to do, because people are crazy. Human trafficking yeah. is real. Right. Mm -hmm. And y'all got to, you know, stay on your P's and Q's. Yeah. yeah. Uh, I think the person should take, uh, Take away from the film that you should stay true to who you are. Mm -hmm. um, trust yes, your true. instincts. Don't be swayed by someone else. Mm -hmm. And know. bring an extra shirt. <laughs> <laughs> you'll, you'll understand that later on. He's the worst. <laughs> Brian. Uh, what I think people are going to definitely take away from it, uh, again, to, not to repeat what you two just said, mm -hmm. but um, definitely be safe when you're talking to people mm -hmm. um, online over any type of dating app, dating app, uh, social media. Right. Mm -hmm. You plan to meet up with somebody, talk to them, have talked to them for a few months. Yeah. You know, phone calls, try to FaceTime. I mean, there's apps that where you can see the other person. To right. Make sure they Definitely. are who they, who they say, say they are. Do your due diligence. Make right. sure these pictures life, yeah. are real. You got to do some research. You know? right. Find out who right. they know. All exactly. kinds of stuff. Right. And make sure you, somebody knows where you're at. Right. Mm -hmm. Turn you know, that that's location good. on. That's a good one. Tell yeah. you. So, and just right. be safe. Be yeah. safe. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just like, uh, oh. I just feel like a lot of, they're gonna um, take away like don't lie. Yeah, so it's not good to tell lies because you got to keep telling the lie on top of that Come lie on, on that gotta, lie. And remember, that lie. Right. And you gotta remember right. the last just lie. Just be honest with yourself. Be honest too. with who you mm. are, and be and love who you are. Yeah. You know, yeah. if somebody don't yourself. like you, oh well. 
Okay, so I have one last question before we get out of here. Mm -hmm. um, because the film is primarily about online dating, and I'm sure many of us have had experiences. I would love to know which of you have gone on an online date, and if so, how did it turn out? Dum -dum -dum. Each of you, mm -hmm. share. Just a bit, just really briefly if you can. I, I went so. on a hard, um, an online dating. Oh, so you almost said horror. <laughs> <laughs> I was about to say it was a pass. It was a hard pass. No, but I met a guy online, and um, he looked the same when I when we link, linked up or whatever. You know, we went out for drinks and stuff. But he was just, he had a terrible personality. His whole demeanor and everything was just different. It, it was just really, online. right. It's like he had built up his character. Based off, like basically like the movie, he built this character that he wasn't, and then I immediately picked up on it. So it was literally a hard pass, and I blocked him right after. Mm. Mm. Have you ever tried it? No. no. I, He's above I, it. No, no. He said it's above me now. I, just, I, see, I see social media as a stalker uh, prone platform. Right. Um, I usually try to attend. I, most of my Facebook friends are people that I actually work with mm -hmm. right. or that I grew up with. And that's who I try to stay in contact with because right. people are crazy. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. People, Definitely. Well, in general, people are inherently good, but people can people be crazy. Who, right. No, they're crazy. Sense. So, yeah. yeah I'll be watching him. I'm crazy vacation. myself, but I don't want to deal with the craziness. So. <laughs> <laughs> I don't need more crazy. I watch you go on vacation all the time. Mm. You be Thank you, I need much. one now. So. <laughs> 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 all right, Brian, have you ever done online dating? Yes, I've gone on a, a few online dates. Oh, few. Yeah, that's, more, that's, well, that's more than one. Yeah. <laughs> Any love wow. matches from that, or uh, was it all bad? Well, one was, but that's a long story that we ain't getting into. We'll talk about it. Uh, <laughs> we're going to put it later on. Right? <laughs> But um, I met some really cool people, um, mm. and I'm still friends with some of them. Some okay. of them, I was just like, yeah, no. Yeah, no? <laughs> no? Why do we do that? The yeah, no? Yeah, no. Yeah, no. Yeah. All right. So, but this won't happen again. Yeah, yeah <laughs> no, it, it didn't. I met a lot of people in my DMs, but, oh, okay. like, really do. Um, I have never had the opportunity to actually go out with one and of the guys, mm -hmm. but it's one guy that I've been talking to online for like six months. Okay. I know he looked good. I just don't know if he catfishing his personality. Oh, you know, that can happen. That yeah. can happen. So, oh. give me his information. I'll tell you who he really right. is. We can look him up. Well, you know, I FBI. You know, the women. Hey. We be finding out. <laughs> <laughs> uh huh. Nigga, he married. Let me know who he is. Give me his info. All right. Right. FBI. He really live in Honduras. He got twelve kids. We will see. Like he's every. I see one of emails from like Somalia. Right. I'm willing to try it. I do want to try it. You're yeah. to try it. Okay, that's not bad. So, well, how about yourself? I've dated people online. I'm sure you have. <laughs> no. <laughs> and how was your experience? I mean, it's been it's been fun and weird at the same time because people do catfish and lie and personalities. You yeah, can't really tell a personality online. Right. And like I said, I met you online. He swears. I did. He's such a liar. I didn't meet you online. You didn't meet me online. You well, I met you. So let me tell you guys, because really, <laughs> I don't care well, how I much time you. we run right now, Where but I'm not going to you guys, okay? When's so the first we, time I contacted you? Were, you did message me, but not I'm for online. that purpose. I know, but I said I met you. Right? I love this. I love this. <laughs> we're like, we're it's like, this is a movie. You said this is a movie. Because we I'm know that. No, so we were working on a web series, the first web series we both ever did. And he just got signed on to be the director. And he reached out to everyone. Hey, I'm the director. You didn't meet me. So he would like reach out to everyone. Hey, I'm the director for the film and uh what do you do on the film blah, 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 whatever, whatever whatever the case may be and we met in person no i met you online first i reached out to you say what's you up you reached out to everyone so you dated everyone it's not the same it's not the same it's not the same online who have you met online besides that i need to know these are real questions I real life dating is <laughs> apparently this relationship is not going to work online dating is not a success because <laughs> <laughs> we can't even get our story straight obviously <laughs> that's not the same <laughs> that is not the same still met you online that's the first time I contacted So you first interacted online, but online. you met yes. okay. That's what it is. You That's what, what, it, what it sounds saying. like. You see what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but it's not best, like it's I started from a mess. I'm yeah. crossing all my eyes, dotting right. all my teeth. And we told you to go for it. And look at where y'all at see, now. See? Yeah, started from a message. Now you're here. Boom. See what Boom. So, what kind of friends we are? Something, something worked. Something brewed. <laughs> I make bad decisions in life. No, I'm kidding. Oh, uh, I can't. Wow. I can't. I can't. See that? Wow. 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 No, wow. baby, I'm going to start my life. Well, then. I'm the reason. I'm the reason. Oh, God. He wants credit for everything. Well, he kind of It is his baby. All right. It's fine. But no, um... <laughs> Apparently, I hate all of these people, and this is my last time <laughs> working with all of them, especially That's him. a lie. Uh, especially, literally, I've probably worked with everyone more than once so far. Uh, Niall for a music video. Mm -hmm. um, 
Malika for a music video as well too. And we worked on Feminine together. Mm -hmm. um, a film, your first project, yeah, your first time acting. Yeah. Um, Marjorie saw me at work. We auditioned together somewhere. He does not remember if I like do my research. I'll my figure it out. My memory is bad anyway. It's, it's <laughs> obviously sure, yeah, you all know that. Um, and it as is. far as Brian, we, I was a guest on his show, actually talking about my last film, sure. Decisions of Sorrow. He was co-hosting a radio show. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, that's what's up. Anybody got lives, people? Right. But yeah. most importantly, we want to thank the cast for being here because we have to wrap up. We're so short on time. Um, I want to thank the cast again for being of here. Course. Cast of date bait coming soon, so please look out for that. Follow the okay, Instagram that page. Okay. Um, the Instagram page is at date bait film, <laughs> and the Facebook page is this exact same thing, date yep. bait film. Mm -hmm. Make sure you watch Beyond the Surface each and every Sunday at 3 p.m. on Facebook Live. Uh, so it's facebook.com forward slash Beyond the Surface Live. Check everybody out. I'll hook up your social media so everybody can support you all Follow because me. that's important. Because we never know what kind of acting gigs you're going to get because yes, of this. For sure. And they love your personalities, right? Like, <laughs> <laughs> Come on. Do it all up. Do it all. Yeah. Do it all. Yeah. Do it all. 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 Check like everything out. Yeah. Check all of them out. We're going to hook you up. And we thank you once again for being a part of it. And we hope you, you enjoy the Thanks film, too. Yes. Make sure y'all yes. share it. If you're yes. part of the cast, share it. Let the people know to we watch it. Because it's watch important. It. We independent. We watch market it. and we promo. We film. We Y'all know what we're doing. I'm yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the the struggle, baby. Boom.